name is Abayomi Azikwe. I'm with the Moratorium Now Coalition, and I'm also with the Committee to Beat Back the Right to Work. Uh, we're here today in Lansing, uh, December 11th, uh, 2012, to express our outrage at this horrendous effort aimed at economic terrorism against working people here in the state of Michigan. They're telling us that right to work will create more jobs, more opportunity for the working class. This is totally false. All of the studies indicate that all of the 23 other states that have enacted right to work, workers make less money, they're more impoverished, they have higher unemployment rates. This will do absolutely nothing except drive down living standards, drive down wages, and destroy jobs here in the state of Michigan. We are demanding that this bill be defeated. If passed, we are demanding that it be repealed. And if that doesn't work, we're calling upon all of the trade unions here in the state of Michigan to prepare and to authorize for a general work stoppage here in the state of Michigan. That is the only way in which we can send a clear message to the bosses and to the bankers that we've had enough and that we have to reverse the horrendous situation that we're facing, not only here in Michigan, but throughout the United States and, of course, throughout the world. survive if the unions survive. So Rick Snyder, stop this attack on the middle class and the unions of this great state of Michigan where it all started. My name is Stephen uh, Matthews. I'm Santa and uh, I just want to let uh, the uh, state of Michigan know that uh, uh, Rick Snyder is getting nothing but coal in his stocking, and I'm here to support my elves who are all union workers. Steve Wyatt, retired Ford worker, UAW member. Uh, we're here in Lansing to protest Governor Snyder and the right-wing legislature funded by folks that are standing on third base and think they were hit a triple, they were born there, and we're here to protest the taking away of our democracy. People decide by a majority to join a union, and the majority in this country rules always have. Our standard of living is important to us, and we want to protect Michigan rights. I'm here today in memory of my grandfathers who both started the UAW 75 years ago. I'm here to support them and keep the movement going. My father called home one night. He was at work on the second shift. And he said, Ida, we're on strike. It's a sit down. I'll be home when it's over. And he was 44 days later. A, it was a, a wonderful time for a young girl. I was just, I was 17 two days later. Uh, I was so thrilled and I was so proud of my father. It was a wonderful, wonderful time. But let's not let all those things that they worked so hard for and the beatings that he took from the company people, uh, let's not let that go to waste. Let's keep this union going. We've got to. If you want to write to work, then that means you, you work for nothing or, or whatever somebody, want, somebody wants you to. It's, a, it's an awful thing. It would be such a disgrace to let it go. And I'm sure the man who, I'm sure the man who would sign that, the, that paper didn't have to be hungry. Never. I was raised during the, I was raised during the Depression and we didn't have much to eat sometimes. I imagine that man who signs that paper 
should be so ashamed. Because very much if he, if he ever had to do any manual labor in his life. Yeah. Hey. Know, maybe push a lawnmower or something, but I doubt that too. <laughs> Anyhow, it's it's wonderful to be here. You go, girl. Keep, keep working for the union. It, it's a, a salvation.